Hello my beautiful LinkedIn friends. So today I want to talk about something a little bit different, a little bit outside of what I normally do. I try to keep this vlog and the content I make positive, helpful, but I've come to a realization that needs to be spoken about. So as part of my verbalize.science journey, I've been thinking about the act of communicating science, why scientists don't do it more often. And I've come to this realization that academia is fundamentally flawed. I've realized that the academia suffers from terrible short termism. So scientists are not rewarded for actually doing science. They are rewarded for bringing in grant money and publishing peer reviewed papers. That is pretty much the only two things that scientists can use to ensure career progression, to get accolades, to uh, further their own research. And that flies completely in the face, I think, of what science is all about. Science is about gathering information, making lives better. And I really think that the university system and the systems in which scientists work are fundamentally corrupted. At Verbalize.Science, we want to help scientists communicate, but the fact is they are not rewarded for communicating because the system creates short-termism where scientists are not rewarded for the things that they actually want to do, which is science and communicate that science more broadly. But there needs to be a fundamental change in the way universities and other research organizations reward their scientists. And at Verbalize.Science, I wanna be part of that change. I wanna make sure that scientists communicate because they they're not about hoarding information or being the first or, or not collaborating because of the competition. It's, it's kind of like an unspoken thing about science. We know it happens. People in science know it's happening. But unfortunately, the system encourages short-termism. Communication is a huge part of the scientific process, but is completely undervalued. And therefore, the system creates a state where the science is not implemented. People work in silos, they're super competitive. Communication will help the entire scientific process, but it is not rewarded in the same way that bringing in grant money is. And I think until a fundamental systemic change of academia happens, we are gonna be seeing an increase and a continuation of the distrust of science of politicians completely ignoring science. This short-term focus, this finite game that academia has become, I think has to change. All right, I'm gonna sit here, eat the rest of my, do you eat or drink a smoothie? If you work for, or you are the head of an institution that wants to make an absolute impact and a change in the way science is fundamentally done in your institution, let me know, because I want to work with you.